We hope the, the, we've got two microphones this time, so uh, it's, we're delighted to welcome Callum. Callum's a, a new player, and firstly, Callum, thank you for giving us your time today. We do appreciate it. Um, but perhaps not what you wanted to do on the first game of the season. No, it's not really um, how I thought at the start of the season, to be honest, injured, but it's one of the things you can't do nothing about it, can you? So. so tell us about the injury, what actually happened, and how long do you think you'll be out for? It's quite funny actually because we got given the day off on the Thursday and I've come in to do extras with the gaffer and um, two hours into the session it was the last bit of the of the session and I've gone to strike a ball with my left foot and I pulled my quad so um, hopefully we'll be back within a couple of weeks so I think so. Well that'll serve you right for being keen won't it? Yeah no, I like, <laughs> you shouldn't be so busy should I? <laughs> so we, we had a glimpse of you last season, you came here on loan from Wrexham. What can fans expect to see from you uh, when, when you eventually get out and play? Um, I'd like to think that I'm quite an exciting player. I like to get fans off their feet, uh, running at players, being direct, quick, skillful, and create chances and goals. So, yeah. Fantastic. You started your career at Northampton Town. Tell us a little bit about your time at Northampton. Yeah, I was at Northampton Town uh, from the age of 10, I think it was, until I was 18. And then uh, I was with the first team from the age of 16 and then Eddie Bruce really got sacked, the manager come in and didn't even look at us and then got rid of the whole youth team and then I was that really to be honest. So it, you, you, you left Northampton and then you decided that you would like to sort of get signed by former Tamworth managers. So you went to rugby and uh, played under one of our legends, Dale Belford. Yeah. Well, I, after I left Northampton, I went over to Canada for All a right. year. Yeah. Uh, did an American scholarship year, come back a bit early because I wanted to play uh, back in England and then signed for uh, Rugby Town um, and then Dale come in a few games into the season and yeah, I really enjoyed that, playing every single game under him and uh, thought come on leaps and bounds and I thought he was a great man, just to be honest. And you, you were there just for one season, is that right? Yeah, I was just there for the one season, yeah. And um, you obviously attracted the attention of Tamworth, I think, because I think Andy Morrell was quite interested in signing you then. Yeah, I think at the end of that season, because I had a good season, uh, got quite a few goals and assists, and about, I had uh, quite a lot of interest, and then obviously I couldn't uh, turn down the chance to sign for Wrexham, obviously a big club in the conference, and get a lot of fans and full time, so yeah, it, worked, it made sense. Yeah, so you, you went to, to, to Wrexham, ex with manager number two, Gary Mills, did things go as well as you pre-planned for them to go there? Um, I think I went there as an underdog really because obviously I jumped up four leagues from rugby but uh, I coped really well. I think I finished top goal scorer pre-season and then uh, started the season really well as well. First start for Wrexham scored two goals um, and then manager got the sack again, new manager come in, played well with him as well. First six games started and then he changed formation and then I faced him fit. So you play wingers and then you find yourself on loan again so it's just football. And then you went to, to Le Leamington, who were, were obviously playing on Tuesday nights. How, how did things go at Leamington? Um, Leamington was all right. First couple of games, I think my first game was scored. And then uh, we, we played a couple of teams and it was a bad pitch and bad weather. We weren't really getting the ball, we weren't really involved as much. But enjoyed it there, to be honest. Obviously, we won, I think we won every game when I was there. Um, but obviously, when Tamworth come about, obviously, to play. The pitch suits me better, better league. Made more sense again. Great, so you're here at Tamworth. Now, what, what persuaded you to sign on full time then? Because obviously you're with us on loan, you could have gone anywhere, but uh, what was it that attracted you to say, yeah, I'm going to commit my time to Tamworth? I think the most important thing for me this season is, uh, is playing games every week. I think obviously Andy Morrell was really keen to get to get me in. Um, he was on to me all summer when I was away, and he was always asking and, and, uh, and trying to keep me in the loop and stuff like that. So I thought, that, that was interesting, you're always nice to be wanted. Obviously you've seen a lot of me from when I come online to last school rooms last season, so I've already been here, it's quite familiar for me and like I said, it's a good set up here, it pitch suits me, I think um, just want to be playing games and, and do well, do push on. So how long do you think you'll be out? How, how long before fans can see you playing? I'd like to think, uh, I would imagine I'm aiming for Persian National. Brilliant. So, Callum, it's great to meet you, great to, to hear from you, and we wish you all the best this season. Ladies and gentlemen, Callum Powell.